Creeping silently through the unforgiving depths of the Sword Coast's ancient woodlands, a mischievous and chaotic creature lurks. This pint-sized enigma, known far and wide for its chaotic exploits throughout Faerun, finds its home in concealed caverns and crude camps near bodies of water. Welcome back to Meet Your Monsters, where we explore the iconic inhabitants of Dungeons and Dragons. Today we bring the troublesome goblin to light. Part of the original release of D&D &D back in 1974, the goblin has been a staple to dungeon masters for almost 50 years. Goblins are small, standing about three and a half feet tall, with lean frames and sickly green or mottled skin. They have sharp jaws and snarling expressions, and their beady eyes gleam with a feral intensity. Clad in tattered rags and wearing crude bone jewelry, goblins have a savage and cunning presence. The bane of level one baby players, goblins tend to come in groups, setting up camps and spending their days stealing, killing, and just generally being little bastards. Motivated by greed and a chaotic yearning for evil doing, goblins are unpredictable in nature. They are adept fighters, utilizing their high stealth and cunning nature to their advantage. They excel in setting somewhat clever traps, alarms and ambushes in order to gain the upper hand on their unsuspecting foe. They tend to wield scimitars in close combat and short bows at range both with plus four to hit. They also can utilize their nimble escape to dash away so a DM running them should keep them very mobile throughout the encounter, creating fast-paced crazy scenes with wild action. They usually have a leader, often the strongest of them, but occasionally a physically dominant leader of another race like a bugbear or hobgoblin. Responsible for more level one player deaths than any other monster in the history of Dungeons and Dragons, Goblins are the underrated lightweight champions of D&D. &D. Their versatile environments make them handy for a random encounter or planned ambush alike. So next time your new players decide to wuss out and try to take a long rest in a cave they know is inhabited, drop a handful of these little shits on the battle map and crush your players under the weight of their own bad decisions. What's your favorite encounter with the goblins? Let us know in the comments and drop us a subscribe to help us grow.